I will not! I will not! You gotta swim! You gotta get out of the pools, close in five minutes, swim! I am staying. I am staying at the edge. No! Right? They're gonna get mad at us, they're gonna hurt us real bad if you don't get out that pool right now! <laughs> Jesus, Malcolm! I made a promise to myself, all right? I made a promise that once I got in this pool, I would never leave. <laughs> Come on, Malcolm, you know the YMCA. Don't work like that. <laughs> Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Just stop it! And then you see the lifeguard like on his tower. He's got like a sedative, got, like, a sedative sniper gun. The <laughs> sun has three minutes to get out of the pool before I get. Son, you have to get out of the pool. He will take the shot. He will take the shot. This is what I'm talking about, Dad. And there's uh, another lifeguard over here. <laughs> take the shot. <laughs> Clear shot of him. This lifeguard also has a, like a little buddy with binoculars. <laughs> Give me a reason. Give me a fucking reason. And I will pull this trigger. Malcolm. Please. Got mac and cheese at home, Malcolm. I remember what it's like to mac and cheese, Malcolm. Malcolm. Daddy, I have water now. Close up on the sniper's finger and the trigger. And the close up on his fucking eyes. Sweat. A lot of wrinkles near his eyes, too. <laughs> Do it, you have this. You will not shoot the water, I promise you. You will not shoot the water. His head is clearly above the water. Clear, 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 fire, take the shot. If I fuck this up by just one millimeter, I'm going to shoot this water. suits are saying, if, if they don't shoot you, which I don't want them to do, they're going to shoot the water and the water dies. <laughs> the Packers have this choice, Malcolm, I didn't do it this I'm sorry to say, but we can buy more water. We're the YMCA after all. We've got all this public fun. It's not going to be the same. It's not going to be the same, goddamn. It's true, boss. We've all gotten to know this water. <laughs> Really I've taken my kids here. I've taken them here. They're going to know. And, uh, the captain is talking to both of them on his microphone. Listen, I uh, I don't have a family, so this water doesn't really mean a lot to me. I'm captain of the YMCA. They chose me because they knew I have little to die for, but a lot to. A lot to make people get upset at. I'm sorry, but I cannot let this water go. I will not put it at risk. Uh, Captain? <laughs> Malcolm! No! And, uh, wait, this is the guy with the binoculars. <laughs> not on my watch! <laughs> out of his hand. <laughs> and then it lands in the kid's hands in his hand. Yes! Malcolm! Come on! Liberate us! <laughs> the kid will never do it. He can't swim and shoot at the same time. <laughs> Son, toss me the gun. Toss me the gun. Toss it to your daddy. Yeah! <laughs> Why don't you go suck on a lamp? <laughs> He's still walking towards the dead. <laughs> I told you, I ain't got nothing to die for! <laughs> Shove the gun through his head.
Fuck dude, get out of the pool. Daddy! My boy, my boy, come to me. Come to your daddy. Come to your daddy. <laughs> this guy, uh, zombie lifeguard. He's just still, like, flopping around. <laughs> I don't have much longer. I've been brutalized. <laughs> I want you to go back home. I want you, to, I want you to eat the mac and cheese. <laughs> you don't, don't ever, don't ever let your mother marry another man. <laughs> I'll pray for you, Dad. I'll be Dad, and Mom will be my wife. <laughs> 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 and then the boy goes home to mom, boy who is home. knitting. I assume your father is parking the car. He's not going to park the car anymore, mom. Can you get the car away? <laughs> <laughs> Mom, you're, you're so sweet and innocent. I always wanted to be Trans Am. <laughs> my sweet mom, my daddy's, my daddy's gone. But he told me to be dad now. <laughs> when you say he's gone, you mean he left? He, he's dead. The wife's gay men shot <laughs> Who are you doing this for? <laughs> Mom, I just said Dad died. Who are you playing cute for? <laughs> I just really miss him already, you know? It's going to be different with me as Dad. <laughs> dad was too weak. And <laughs> you're only 12 years old. You can't do that. You can't do that. Uh, Shut up, you woman. <laughs> uh, hey, I, hey, I need this. Hey, hey. <laughs> they don't call me woman. You call me mommy. Okay? You call me mommy or mama. <laughs> I just want I want things to be harder in this house. Dad was too <clears throat> soft. He just wanted to cook me food all day. That's why I loved him. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's uh, the little sister, Katie, who was like, uh, I don't know, like two years younger than him, and she's like headphone girl, like super plugged in. And then she's, <laughs> she's like, Jesus, Mom, now that Dad's gone, you're never going to find another man. You were lucky. <laughs> <laughs> you shut up. You shut up. What? Malcolm, go to your room. Malcolm, go to your room. You're, room. Right, you're not dad. You're not dad. You're Malcolm. not dad. You're not dad, Malcolm. Okay? I've got his blood flowing through my face. Keep the dog I... away from the broken glass. Keep the dog away from the broken glass. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Take what? the dog. Take the dog. Oh my god. <laughs> The car? Did the car go? Did the car go? The car went with Dad. When Dad died, the car died too. <laughs> okay. Alright, you know what? We're just gonna stick you up right here. We're gonna play doctor in the house. Okay? Take a seat. Take a seat. Take a seat. Take a seat. Keep this up. Alright? <laughs> Katie's still playing games. <laughs> From this shot, it's like a close-up of her. You just see mom and blood. <laughs>
Next door neighbor Roger. Next door neighbor Roger. <laughs> you McGillicuddy's need to get out of here. You can get out of here right now. The YMCA is looking all over for you. Why is the YMCA looking? You two went to the pool. We and your papa went to the pool. What happened? What happened? Michelle McGillicuddy, I'm sorry. Uh, your, your husband is no more. He, he is passed. <laughs> Purposes without dad. Not to see, because there's two specific men. You know? Like, you just, you're just hanging around. You're not doing anything. You know, thanks for neighbor Roger. I've never seen my mom get out of the house in all my 12 years of life. She's never, this is pretty much all she does. Just hanging out at home all the time. I'll take the boy and I'll raise him to be a proper man. <laughs> His father's dead and he'll need raising. Raising, not raising. <laughs> Whatever, Mom. This is stupid. I would have been, I would have been sad about you leaving if you hadn't become an alcoholic right after walking in here. Hey, hey, my father died. Okay. I hate it when you fight, Mommy and Daddy. Oh. See, she thinks I'm dead. It's working. Maybe we could make this work. Boy, boy this is gross and absurd. <laughs> Maybe you should go, Malcolm. Maybe you should go with him and become a man. Come back to me when you're a man. neighbor <laughs> 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 Roger. I want to make you a man. Once you're a man, you can do whatever you want with your man powers. If that is, have sleeping time with your mom. You can do that. You're a man now, so whatever you want. All right, Mom, I know what my mission is now. I have become a man for you to come back to you. Is that? Yep. <laughs> right, well, I mean, I don't know. I never... Okay, well, I'll get him back to you. <laughs> All right. Hey, don't be a stranger. <laughs> Please stop! Please stop! Please stop! We don't need it. We don't need it. Please, we don't need it. Please, we don't need it. Sister, sister, get you know she's like ten, so she's too weak. So they just end up kissing the side of the sister. Oh no! Oh no! I'm just taking some Codex. All right, boys. He's gonna teach the kid how to become a man. I'm gonna give you intensive training, and you're going to have to kill the people at the YMCA. Because they're coming for you. They're coming to kill you. That'll make me a man. I'll have to kill each person at the YMCA, and it'll be like levels and badges, or like in Pokemon or something. Like I'll just get stronger by having people to defeat. Right. Oh. Take this knife. <laughs> Bring someone out for you. <laughs> I'll leave it in there for him so he don't bleed out. Uh, okay. <laughs> Malcolm, come on. I, I, I'm so sorry, but he's given me such an ultimatum that if I don't learn to kill, I'll be killed. Ah, yeah! I like it! I like it! I like it! I, I like it! I like it! I like it! 
Yeah. Very good. Now let's do a quick montage where you're running on logs and stuff. <laughs> at the front, this guy chained up. Wait, wait, you don't want to do this. I've tried to fight the YMCA. They'll just curse you, like they've done me. <laughs> curse? I don't believe in curses, old man. <laughs> Every morning I wake up an old man, and then I turn into a dog. <laughs> It's like, it's like, uh, it's not as bad as the guy in Olympus who gets his guts picked out by the big bird. It's like, it's less than that. <laughs> Is being a dog cool? I'm not really a hungry dog. I get turned into a hungry dog. <laughs> it's not a fun time. A dog hardly has anything to think about. I always thought here. dogs would have fun. Yeah, me too. You know what the difference between you and us is? We're humans all the time and there's two of us. Right? <laughs> we can beat a curse. Yeah, we can beat a curse. We've got two men. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> oh, you freed me. I don't come back to life. I just... I just turned into a dog. Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> so, I and a dog with wings flies out of here. Whatever. It was like a long shot of spirits flying away, just unnecessarily long, and then when we cut, we're in the we're in the, a dungeon. We yeah. didn't see them enter the castle. Don't worry about it. Yeah. <laughs> There's an old man with a torch. Oh, traveler. You come into the YMCA? What is he looking for? We're looking for the remaining captains of the YMCA. <laughs> Tell them where they are, Sluggy. <laughs> yes, this is Sluggy, the man who guards the YMCA after hours. Only because you're my cousin. Yeah. They're on the third floor. They're on the third floor. In the captain's quarters. It's a, it's a room with a golden door. And on the door, there's, there's animals stapled to the door. By their tails. Okay. And the handle is red for the door. I mean, this is specific the door, but I'm sure if I find a gold door with animals on it, I, I found the right one. There's more than one. Yeah, yeah, not true. There are a lot of animals. They all have different colored handles. Oh, that's how we distinguish each room from the other. So they're in the red one. They're in the red handled gold door with animals. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Look out! 
say, oh, he's just going to let us pass. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's just, yep. It's <laughs> great to have family in the business. <laughs> <laughs> yep, animals, all right. <laughs> the red door handle. So I guess this is my test, huh? Yes. I want you to go in there. I want you to just kill everyone in the room. Don't even ask who they are. <laughs> if they have family there, just take care of all of them because their kids are going to come back and they're going to want blood. That's what kids do. Alright. <laughs> And then, like, uh, the YMCA guys are in here, and they're all feeding their babies in a row. <laughs> <laughs> they, they, have a, they have a slot bucket, like, pigs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they're just pouring applesauce into the thing. <laughs> 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 Alright, so you hey, smash it with a wooden spoon. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. <laughs> you share. You share. <laughs> YMCA person, baby, janitorial service. <laughs> he started calling all of them all the YMCA banisters for basketball champions. And all the lights started coming in from outside. And then the, the guys from YMCA, they start to burn up because they're also vampires. <laughs> <laughs> Cousins with the slug. <laughs> you set me up. Clearly, I did. <laughs> you were all along. You were the one that came for me. Yeah. You were the YMCA that came to get me. All the pieces were there. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of neighbor would bring his kid into the woods to become a man? <laughs> no. What kind of neighbor would intrude on a family meeting? Moments after her father died and then take the son away. I was going to kiss my mom, all right? I was going to kiss her. That's gross. <laughs> I became the man of the house. I have every right. I'm, I'm killing you because you killed a brother in the YMCA armed forces of mine. But I feel good that I'm stopping you from having relations with your mother. <laughs> it was my dad. I was just in the pool and I threw him the gun. Well... Black like father, black like son, the apple don't go nowhere. <laughs> yeah, the kid puts it oh, oh, oh no! Oh, oh, oh. The vampires are like, oh no, the sun is starting to believe. <laughs> what do you mean he's starting to believe? He has nothing to die for. <laughs> nothing to die for? What is it? What is that? What does that do for a gun going through his head? <laughs> it means he it means he can't die! He can't die? Yeah, he can't die! How do you kill what can't be killed? <laughs> Any way you can. <laughs> <laughs> He just blows his head up, the kid lies dying there, his spirit comes out. The YMCA gather for a moment because they think they've won. <laughs> <laughs> it's over. But then the ghosts of all the YMCA people that they killed come through the window. And it's like that in movie Ghost with Patrick Swayze. They, start, <laughs> they pull them underground. No! <laughs> and the ghosts have their vengeance. <laughs> <laughs> and the ghosts have their vengeance, <laughs> and they kill all the guys. <laughs> <laughs> They're underneath the floorboards just getting dragged around. <laughs> 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 